I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. Anyway, let's give this yeah, guy the take. <laughs> I don't think it's often I start a part actually riding the bike and not just coming out of a Pokemon Center. So I want to start, give it a go. Anyway, Saffron. This is currently blocked off by basically everyone in here. Except for that gym, which I don't think I'm going to right now because I sort of went on several little detours over the course of this recording, so this will completely screw you over if you're trying to keep track. <laughs> I think you can skip that gym and then go back to it later. Yeah. Yeah, well, I think I'm going over to Lavender now. Because oh, I've got this self scope. Right? Yeah. What have you got it now? From uh, Giovanni? I don't. Yeah, I got it from Giovanni when I just beat him, so. What have I encountered? Oh, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it was dead. It is now. <laughs> Slowly, slowly, slowly. Uh, the bike in this game is because whenever I play Ruby, uh, uh, I use the mock it's bike most of the time. Thing. Yeah, and so this feels slow. quite slow. Yeah. The bike in X and Y is pretty good, and the themes nice. Yeah. Uh, with X and Y, I find myself not using it all that much because you've got the roller skates. So I use the bike. Quite I use often. it here and there, but like, I don't. It's not like my port call to just turn the bike on there if I'm in the hub. Mm -hmm. Is it one's natural reaction to go for the roller skates? And it's well, they use a circle pad. Yeah. Oh. I just set the uh, bike to the register key items. So, yeah. I've got it on key items, but I just don't think to press it because I'm normally I, going quite fast on the roller skates. So. Yeah, but you have to quite often flick the. Yeah, the I'm the doing tricks. To... <laughs> yeah. Anyway, now we've got the silver scope. We can see the ghosts. And this is a ghastly, and they're all ghastly of them. Yeah, it's actually mostly ghastly, so there's yeah. very little variety in this dungeon at all. <laughs> She's always wonderful, right? Ghost I remember when I played yeah. through Pokemon Blue, I was trying to make a ghost team that consisted of three ghastlies, two haunters, and a Gengar. Well, when you've got three <laughs> ghost types I to know. choose from, there's not much you can do. I know. <laughs> yeah. uh, that, that was a pathetic boss. <laughs> Where's that Pokemon that's like ghastly? Um, mm. Cloister, what? Cloister, yeah, cloister. yeah, the inside of it looks yeah. sort of like a ghastly People space. People say that yeah, yeah, ghastly so is a cloister it. that's dead. <laughs> and I ship it with Onyx. That's a pretty good <laughs> oh, yeah. I love how there is actually a battle in Heart, Gold and Soul Silver, which is like a young couple, and one of them's got an Onyx and the other one's got a cloister. <laughs> that's <laughs> yeah. that's, that's healing one. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. They should have that everywhere. Yeah. Well, they sort of do actually go through the totally not Viridian Forest in. Oh, there must be a one we haven't seen yet. It must be. Hi, Hunter. It definitely looks better than Gengar. Yeah, it, uh, it does I look like quite good. Gengar. Gengar is really cool. It's yeah. just Hunter, so it looks a bit better in my eyes. I might like Ooh, the detail cool. on the sprite on this. It's got red glow around his hand. Not just yeah. that, but look at the shading, the shading at the top of his head. Very good. Yeah. When we were in a world online where my sprite design consists of let's take a Pokemon and recolor it. <laughs> yeah. And you kind of appreciate good pixel art. Yeah. And Overlord grew up a bit. And Dragon Ray. That's quite useful at this stage in the game because yeah. well, at this point, 40 damage is quite a bit of damage, so you can normally do two or three hit kills. Yeah, at very least. consistent. Yeah. That's so awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Look. Two text messages. That was so much easier than having to wait for Nurse Joy to stick the things in that machine. And to say, I hope yeah. to see you again. I don't know why she was hoping to see again. you again. Does she still say that in like oh, yes. recent yes. games? Even X and Y? No. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I thought we would have changed it. No, uh, people love it when their nurse is <laughs> telling them that they want them to get hurt again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think it's one of the things that to this day you can't really change now because yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. it'd stick out too much. The amount of traditions they've kept going, like for through the series. I'm glad they've kept it, yeah. But like oh we're at Marak here, but like there's a hiker in the, all the opening towns talking about how amazing technology is. I don't know if you noticed that. And it kinda of changes with the times. So like they're talking about whatever new communication breakthrough there is. Do you but attempt to catch it? I can't remember. You can't catch it. Oh, can, oh. can you not with this one? No, I tried. Oh, in, yeah, you can't. I tried in blue. I was like, I got it onto the lowest health paralyzer. I was like, catch it. Fuck, I can't catch a ghost. Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. 
<laughs> there couldn't be any flaws at all with bringing something back from the dead. It would have been good if they actually made this a ghost ground type during this battle. That would have taken effort. <laughs> yeah, but it would have been good. What, what am I doing? Do? What am I doing? <laughs> but, oh yeah, I remember now. <laughs> Am I gonna try again? Uh, yeah, <laughs> like Master Ball. I see, I see stuff like this, and I worry about past me and whatever stupid shit he's tried to do. Bone meringue, <laughs> yeah. Bone meringue, Dan. Just Imagine so, if you try for a Master Ball. Yeah. It's like, like yeah. it's still going. Kind of, oh, it's got one hundred percent catch. It's be like this doesn't work. Well, like, in G one, it didn't. Uh, there was still one in two five five possibility that it would like uh, fail to capture it, mm. and that's purely like. The programming fix, the way they'd work and program the capture system in Gen 1, it was impossible to have a 100% catch rate. Like how it shows in Origins that when Red tries to capture a Pokemon, when it breaks out, it actually shows the Pokemon blowing up. Sure. It breaks apart. I love that, it departed to the afterlife. Like, you could have said, it died again. <laughs> Team Rocket. It died again. Not going to forget this. No. How will I know if I rebattle you? You're all the same. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I it's... wonder if they're clones. <laughs> yeah. Well, they've got the exact same sprite, so in a way. Yeah. <laughs> and they carry the same Pokemon. Pretty much. Super, yeah. bat, so rat poison cake, poison type. They don't specify it with a type, but if I had to say it'd be poison type, yeah. really. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, uh, spoke to him, now he's going to give me item Poker Flute. Yeah. Now we can move fast. No, that is. Yay. I like not the, specific oh, I like it. how they brought back Snorlax in X and Y, blocking yeah. a bridge. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Sprite's pretty cool for that. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a model now, isn't it? Yeah. 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 What am I buying, I wonder? Mm. Yeah. And then there's the guy who's obsessed <laughs> with his fur for Alan. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's... Harry's thinking about Pokey models, like, put the no. Pokemon out, you like most models up there. No, I'm not that obsessed with Fair Affinity. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm. Or you could just be normal group. and like say you're yeah. obsessed with people and cosplay as dressers like Pokemon. I'm not even that. 